Unpacking the phrase, deck load, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone, welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore an interesting phrase, deck load. This might be a new term for many of you, and it's definitely worth understanding, especially if you're interested in nautical terms or expressions used in transportation and logistics. So, let's dive in and unravel the meaning of deck load together. Before we combine the words, it's important to understand them individually. The word deck typically refers to a platform on a ship or boat. It's the flat area where people can walk or items can be placed. On the other hand, load refers to something that is carried or a quantity of something that is transported. It can be anything from cargo to passengers. When we put these words together, deck load refers to the cargo or goods that are carried on the deck of a ship, boat, or even a vehicle like a truck. This is in contrast to cargo that might be stored below deck or inside a vehicle. The deck load is visible and exposed to the elements, which is an important aspect in logistics and transportation. Understanding where and how the phrase is used is key. Deck load is a term you'll commonly hear in nautical settings, shipping industries, and logistics. For example, a sailor might say, we need to secure the deck load before setting sail, which means they need to make sure that all the items on the deck are safely tied down. Let's see how deck load is used in sentences. 1. The captain was concerned about the deck load during the stormy weather. 2. Regulations often specify the maximum deck load a vessel can carry. 3. The workers spent the afternoon loading the containers onto the deck load area. These examples show how deck load can be used in various contexts, emphasizing its relevance in specific situations. I hope this video has helped clarify the meaning of deck load and how it's used in English, particularly in maritime and transportation contexts. Remember, Understanding such specific phrases not only enriches your vocabulary but also helps in grasping the nuances of the language. Keep practicing, and don't hesitate to rewind and rewatch if you need to. See you in our next video, and happy learning!